Yeah, I want to reduce this. So I picked this up and I want to review it because this is a Singaporean uh, instant noodle brand which has, in my opinion, the best instant noodles. Even better than Indomie because uh, I think most of you will know the Yi Bai Hao or Cha Mi or whatever people call it now. Uh, but not the point. So this brand came out with Mala Siang Go. So yeah, enough for play. Let's just, just bust this open right now. Garnish. Step one, and garnish. <laughs> it didn't come with garnish. <laughs> Supposedly during cooking videos, <laughs> don't know how to cook instant noodles. Don't know how to cook. Oh no, it's dry. So, got it cooked, but I forgot to cook the garnish. Anyway. Even from the get-go when I just put all the seasoning in, right, the smell is very, very strong. Try. So nervous. <laughs> I don't know why. Wow, it's loud, eh. Oh, it's so spicy. And it's very salty also. Ayo, they went less smart as I was expect to suit the Singaporean taste but it's wow it's really really I want to say it's like a bit more than zhong la and it's very salty is it because I really want to eat instant noodles today? and there's this kind of flat taste of an instant noodles I mean the but for people who love mana siangko right you will instantly identify the dif you will instantly realize the difference between this and a uh, fresh mana siangko but as for the flavor profile, I think it's quite similar. It's quite similar to what uh, Singaporeans would expect. Overall decent, uh, but I think it can still be tweaked. Like I feel like there, there's improvements due for this recipe. Especially since that I don't see Miojo going any, anywhere anytime soon and Mala Senko will be a part of the local food scene. I, I, I suspect. Uh. I also think that other instant noodles companies will come up with this flavor quite soon. So yeah, that's all. Um, Why I recommend it? I would recommend eating mala sengko. <laughs> but this is 160. I guess if you are hungry at night and you really really want mala sengko, and there are probably no mala sengko supper spots in Singapore, this can suffice. But yeah, you guys try and let me know what you think about this. Maybe I expected too much because it's Miojo, as in one of my one of the uh, instant noodle brands that I like doing mala sengko, which is my love. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.